Good morning, Expedition 64. Good morning, Expedition 65. Good morning, Expedition 66. We are happy to be working with you today. Good morning. Anytime you can take science experiments and change the variables, you learn something new. And the space station provides unique ability to have solutions where you don't have sedimentation, where you can keep a homogeneous mixture, for example. Buoyant forces just don't work the same way, so the way combustion works is different. But also I'd say space is exciting because we human beings are explorers at our core. And we want to understand better how we fit into the vast scheme of things. And the further we go, the more we learn. Yeah. What was your favorite experiment on the International Space Station? Toby, great question. My favorite experiment was the one that I got to eat. It was us growing hatched chili peppers in our plant habitat. And some of them got frozen to go back to the ground, but many got to stay with us and we ate them. Station Huntsville on two. We have video in node one. Look at those chili peppers. What we're doing in effect is practicing keeping people healthy on a long trip through space. The big difference is when we get our first folks to Mars, we're not going to have a staff of nurses and doctors there to make sure we're healthy and take care of us. So being able to uh, contribute to that is something I will always be very, very proud of. On behalf of the entire control team, we just wanted to say congratulations to you and Piotr on 300 days in space. And we're just so proud of you and all the work you're doing. Yeah, that was very kind of you to say. This is definitely a team accomplishment. Thanks again for the words. It's a beautiful view when you turn off all the lights inside the space station and you can look out the window and it is glorious. And this very thin atmosphere, which is essential to our existence, that's a very finite resource that we need to protect. I will miss the certainty that every day I'm spending contributing with innovations in science, technological demonstrations that are helping out all of humanity and pushing the boundaries of human existence. There is a very strong sense of purpose for all of us up here as we do this work.